Welcome back to TV5 News at 9. Today is Kidneys for Kids Day in Bay County. Joining us this morning to tell us more, we have Brian Martindale. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for having me this morning. I appreciate it. Of course. So, Brian, what is Kidneys for Kids all about? Kidneys for Kids, we find uh, or advocate for living kidney donors for children. We recruit healthy adults around the country to become living kidney donors for children. We educate them on how safe it is to become a living donor, how rewarding it is, and how you can live a, a fulfilling life like I have for almost the last 12 years with one kidney and do the same thing as you did with two kidneys and save a child's life. Definitely. And what is the goal of today's event? Today's events, uh, we were given Kidneys for Kids Day by County Executive Jim Barsha on a Tuesday. And the Tuesday we had a ceremony at uh, Waterside H2O. Um, and it's for our efforts to uh, find kidney donors and recruit uh, adults across the country to uh, donate to these children and save their lives. And also, we raise money um, in the form of grants. Uh, we cover costs not covered by insurance for children going through transplant or treatment across the country. So today, um, we're we're using the day that uh, the county executive Jim Barsha gave us to raise money for our family assistance fund. Um, during my 10,000-mile uh, 22-city trip, which I just completed on Friday in New York City. Congratulations. Thank you. I made all 10,000 miles this year. Uh, we carried out wonderful TV interviews in cities mm -hmm. across the country. Um, and you'll see uh, pictures of children that we are currently helping who are actively getting calls uh, because of these stories uh, from potential kidney donors. Uh, we've helped to match 11 children so far with 11 different donors in 18 months. My goal is 100 kidneys for 100 kids. We'll be doing this over the next several summers. We do this year-round, the advocating. Uh, and the uh, big part of Kidneys for Kids, too, is our micro-grants family assistance fund. So uh, a parent, uh, a family going through a kidney transplant or treatment for their child, they absorb a lot of costs not covered by an insurance. Travel for uh, the transplant or treatment. Uh, lots of medical supplies and things that insurance just doesn't pick up. Mm -hmm. They end up with thousands of dollars of bills, uh, sometimes living on meal trains and donations when they go through a transplant, living away from home. So uh, we help to cover those costs, and that's what we're raising money for today. Um, we start at 11 a.m. with Gilly's Bistro in Bay City. They are throwing a wonderful benefit lunch from 11 to 2. Mm -hmm. um, and then we'll have silent auction items like you see here. This is our featured item. Uh, Jared Goff, uh, Detroit Lions football that was given to us by the Lions front office and has a Lions authentic certificate to go with it. Ooh. And uh, being the start of Lions uh, training camp and uh, close yeah. to the season, I thought this would be a great featured item today. We have a wonderful item from St. Laurent Brothers, uh, from Soaring Eagle Casino that you can uh, bid on today uh, and also on Sunday when we have, um, uh, after today's events, we have a Great Lakes Loons game on Sunday with My Michigan Health. And the mm -hmm. items will be there. Um, this afternoon, there is shopping in downtown Bay City. So downtown okay. Bay City merchants are giving a portion of sales to the Kidneys for Kids Family Assistance Fund. So get downtown if you're in Bay City today. First of all, have lunch, shop downtown, and then we want you to come to Midland Street tonight. Midland Street um, uh, businesses will be donating a portion of their sales uh, in a dual benefit to Kidneys for Kids for Kidneys for Kids Night. We'll have games in the street, we'll have live music from Randy Bedore, from the Family Tradition Band, Mandy Lane, um, uh, Jeff Poyer. Uh, and the dual part is uh, this is a benefit with Brian's house also mm. on uh, Midland Street tonight. So we're, uh, uh, it's a dual benefit. Come down and support both Kidneys for Kids for our Kidneys for Kids Day and Brian's house. They'll have a, a, an, a silent auction tonight and a 50-50 going for their uh, benefit, which is led by um, River Rock. And we have um, Jay, uh, Jay Sanborn uh, in the Midland Street Association leading things for Kidneys for Kids along with Kevin Novello from Brooklyn Boys Pizza. Awesome. So uh, patronize all of the wonderful places yeah. on Midland Street tonight. Bid on our items. We'll have kids games to play out in the street. Come listen to the music. And it's a whole great day for Kidneys for Kids and helping these children and these families who need transplants uh, with the uh, cost not covered by insurance for our fund. And you can learn more about becoming a living kidney donor. Love that. Well, Brian, the work you are doing is admirable. Remind us again, what year did you donate? And just briefly tell us what that experience was like for you. I donated uh, to Jessica Shireen in 2013 after seeing her story on TV5. Her mother had stood uh, in front of our Walmart in Bay City with a big pink sign saying, my daughter's in kidney failure. I can't lose her. Please help. 
I had previously tested for another gentleman in what's called a pair donation who I didn't match in blood type. Um, uh, after seeing Jessica's story, uh, I retested for her at the University of Michigan. Um, just before uh, Thanksgiving of 2012, uh, I found out I was a match as if we were siblings. It was a one in a million match. We matched yeah. as if we, you know, we were family. We never met. We only lived four blocks apart. She got my kidney on January 11, 2013. She was 10 years old. We've got to watch her grow into an almost 23-year-old woman now. She's That's at Eastern amazing. Michigan. She's on our board of directors, and she's been my inspiration wow. to find kidney donors for other children. Truly amazing. Well, Brian, thank you for sharing your story, and thank you so much for being here. You could be a donor as well. You never know. You can find more information on Kidneys for Kids in the hot link section of our website at WNEM.com.